All right. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name again is Larry James. My website is speakwithlarry.com. One word, speakwithlarry.com. Uh, this video, I'm going to title it, You Have to Do Your Homework. <laughs> right? Because in the scheme of life, the big picture, the way you get better is you understand what it is that you're doing and you apply all those little nuances that you've learned along the way and that's what makes you an expert that's what makes you able to charge the big bucks right or create the big deals in the real estate industry the way that goes but uh, I wanted to share with you a little bit about the the research part as you're uh, deciding that you're going to become an expert on whatever it is that you do. And you should be doing that because if you're online a lot, the way you get yourself in a position to generate an income, one of the ways is for people to see you. They need to see you on a regular basis and understand what it is that you do. Because think about this, as many people that peruse the internet all the time, every day, uh, it only takes one person to see you that you need to get you to the next level. But you need to know a little bit about the next level that you want to go to before that one person sees you, right? In other words, you need to know the language that's spoken in that area, right? Let's say you wanted to be a, a professional bowler. I don't know why you would do that. <laughs> no, but let's say you wanted to be a professional bowler because you were good at bowling and you wanted the people to know who you are. When you create content and post it, whether it be videos or the written word, text, or you know, uh, uh, newsletters or podcasts, whatever that content is, some people will see it. And then they'll say, hey, I'm going to share that with so-and-so and, -so and uh, see what they feel about it. It's, uh, it's that type of world we're in today. We're in that type of world where you don't have to really know it all. You just can start something. If you start and you're consistent at it, people will come into your world and ask you, hey, what is it that you're really trying to do? Because my company helps people do that. And if you're really interested in doing it, I can help you, right? That happens a lot. But you have to be able to weed out the ones that are trying to take advantage of you versus the one who are genuinely trying to give you a, a leg up, right? Because... Sometimes they look the same. <laughs> That's called life, right? Sometimes you can't tell the good from the bad. And sometimes the bad is actually better for you than the good. Crazy as that may sound, we're in that type of world. But uh, when you when you decide that this is it, this is it, this is what I'm going to do for you, because it's an individual thing. It's like what I decide for me, it's what I want to do. And it should be like that for you, too, because remember, my audience are baby boomers, people who have gone through the 30 or 40 years old job and no longer want to work for nobody. Uh, those are the people I've reached. I don't want to be dealing with people who are not interested in changing their lifestyle in the, in the form of self-commitment that you're going to deal with the results that you get. If that's not you, then this probably isn't for you because that's not for you. It's It's for the people who are interested in changing a little bit. Now, I'm not saying you're going to become a multimillionaire. Money may not be even your, may not even be your motivation. Because a lot of times, money is not the motivation for people. It Money is a byproduct of the effort and uh, attention that they put into the detail about what it is that they do. But if you don't have money, you won't understand that, <laughs> right? And it's like people with a lot of money a lot of times we think that they, they're flamboyant. You know, they show their money and all that. No, not the people with a lot of money. Because we're in the kind of world right now where you got people that are coming get it, <laughs> right? And uh, it's just like that. So you got to be cautious nowadays. We're in that the 2023 um, year where, hey, anything is happening. There's some crazy things going on. So I'm not going to take uh, a lot of time here. I just want to be able to put some content out today because what I was telling you about, you have to be consistent. Now, sometimes you're going to have like a viral clip 
because it's so good. You want to share this information, da 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 da, and it's right on point. And people receive it, and it's great. And then there's other times, right? But you still want to be consistent with your your process. It's like systems. When you set up a system, if you have like uh, three points for this product to touch before it creates this ink pen, this ink pen, then when it hits each one of those points, when it gets to the ink pen, that's one product, then another product, then another product. That's a system. When you create that system, you don't know, you no longer have to be there operating that system. You can hire me to do it for ten dollars an hour and create the same effect. Or even better, right? So that's how systems are set up. And once you set those systems up, then you get to sit back and watch them, see how they work, you get to monitor them, speed them up, slow them down, make add things to it, right? Because you're growing the process. Same thing with your knowledge base. When you begin, your knowledge base is kind of low. You have more interest than knowledge. But the longer you stay in there, and the longer you do your research and study, you're gonna learn people's names that you didn't know. You're going to learn different types of strategies that you didn't know. You're going to become part of a, a world that, that's going to be your world. And you're going to be the author of that world if you're serious about becoming successful in that particular arena. But it's a time thing. Time will tell, right? Um, if you uh, lose interest or if you get caught up in something else that pulls you over that way, it's going to delay you getting to where you really originally said you wanted to go. And that's all up to you. It's totally up to you. Nobody cares but you. But that's why our self-discipline and our self-commitment to, to ourselves has to be on a high level because we're easily sidetracked in this world today. If things got you going over here, then you're going over here, then you're going over there. And a lot of things we're doing, we're not even doing for ourselves. We're doing for other people. We should help other people, but you have to be committed to helping you as well. All right. I'm going to stop there because I don't want to go seven or eight minutes because I can talk a lot. And I'm trying to keep it under five. I know I'm not going to do that too well. But I'm going to see you guys in the next video. I really thank you. I appreciate you stopping and watching these short clips. I call them short clips because uh, there's a plan for them, you know, in, at the end of the time, at the end of the day. So uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.